from a small glass cube of live aquatic plants to a huge tank full of colorful saltwater predators, anything is possible with the right tank, knowledge, and vision. Here are the top 10 types of fish tank setups you can create and the aquariums you can buy. Starting our list, there's a prime choice for those of you who yearn to host goldfish and fish in water at room temperature. This is a cold water aquarium. Unlike tropical fish, cold water species come from parts of the world where winter temperatures can drop. So these species do not need a heater to survive in most homes as they accumulate to the lower range of temperatures. This is great for people who don't want to deal with an aquarium heater or save on electricity. Here are some stocking options for this set. There's of course the popular goldfish, the wondrous koi, the Japanese rice fish, white cloud mountain minnows, and axolotl. There are many more I'm not talking about here. In fact, there's a whole video about them in the card above, so go check it out. Second on our list is a brackish fish tank. Thriving in coastal realms where freshwater mingles with ocean brine, brackish fish offer a diverse selection of mainly tropical breeds that don't mind salinity. This type of fish really needs aquarium water with a specific gravity between about 1.005 and 1.012. To keep them healthy, you'll need to prepare their water with reef salt and monitor the salinity with a refractometer or hydrometer. It's not so much to do, right? Among your stocking options, you have scats, monos, the vibrant bumblebee goby, and brackish pufferfish varieties. We also can't forget about the archerfish. Hold up, let's give it up for the tropical community setup. The tropical community setup is a top pick in the aquarium hobby. Why? Well, because it lets you keep various freshwater tropical fish together in one tank, and you can mix and match different fish species, creating a diverse and vibrant underwater environment. How cool is that? However, it's vital to do some research for each fish carefully because some prefer different water parameters and temperatures while others just straight up don't get along. More to that, filtration and heating are substantial for this type of fish tank as well. Here are some options you can check out. We have bottom dwellers like the Corydoras and schooling fish like Tetras. There is a huge variety of tropical fish for both these types. Oh, colorful, weird, and wonderful fish are also a great option for this setup and adding them to the tank will create something extremely unique. Also, other creatures like African dwarf frogs, snails, and shrimp can be kept in some tropical freshwater tanks, but we advise you do even more research before you attempt to mix species. Wait a minute, can you do this research? Why, of course, on this very channel, actually, we've got videos about shrimp tank mates and their care. It's another card you should check out on the top of your screen. For those who want fierce fish, the freshwater aggressive tank is one you should check out. It may not be the people's favorite, but there's really something unexplainable and fun about big aggressive fish in your tank. They could actually make the best pets, but most of these species require seasoned hobbyists. Also, choosing their tank mates carefully is such a meticulous job to do, because the fish you think might be a good fit might just end up as lunch, aka dead. For experienced fish keepers, we salute your ability to blend different aggressive species in a tank. However, if you're just starting up, we recommend kicking it off with just one aggressive fish in its own tank. If you really aim for this kind of setup, we offer to you the Oscar fish. Monikered as an aquarium puppy or river dog because of their extremely playful personality. There's also the fabulous red devil cichlid and the YouTube famous Mbu pufferfish. These are options perfect for hobbyists like you. Want saltwater fish color without the hassle? Check out African cichlids. African cichlids stand out as some of the most vibrant and captivating freshwater fish worldwide, with many popular species originating from vast East African lakes, such as Lake Malawi and Lake Tanganyika, offering a plethora of choices for enthusiasts. But given their territorial nature, careful research is essential before combining various species in a single tank. Yet, with the right selection, you can craft a breathtaking display tank. It's also crucial to note that African cichlids typically thrive in hard, alkaline water conditions. For your options, mbunas, peacock cichlids, and haps are some of the types you can keep. You can check out various African cichlid species in a video we created just for you. It's in another card. Now for number six, how about a lovely freshwater aquascape? Did you know that across the globe, hobbyists engage in growing an array of beautiful aquatic plants, crafting stunning aquascapes resembling miniature natural scenes? 
check out some of these photos. And yes, you can do that too. Whether you aim to fashion a magical underwater realm or enhance water quality for your fish while creating an engaging environment for them, a planted aquarium is an excellent choice, my friend. And many species also prefer a heavily planted tank. If you want to try a planted tank, consider stocking options such as cold water species, tropical community species, and explore various aquascape style possibilities to create your own underwater garden. Seventh, the paludarium. It's a hybrid of an aquarium and a terrestrial setup. Okay, if the term paludarium is new to you, you're in for a delightful discovery. This unique type of aquarium seamlessly combines both underwater and terrestrial environments within the same tank, offering a novel and unique experience. This kind of setup usually imitates a swamp, a riverbank, or the shore of a lake. Admittedly, crafting a paludarium is a bit more complicated, but hey, they can be really fun to build and the outcome is greatly satisfying. When considering inhabitants, explore options like nano fish for the aquatic section, an array of aquatic and terrestrial plants, playful frogs, and even the inclusion of turtles. The end result promises to be a truly wonderful masterpiece that captivates both the eyes and imagination. Aquariums are not just for freshwater fish. We can also have some saltwater species. Oh yeah, you heard it right. You can bring the mesmerizing beauty of the sea inside your home with some marine species. Setting up a saltwater aquarium is quite similar to freshwater ones. However, it requires extra gear and knowledge to maintain the right salinity and to ensure a healthy environment for the fish. When it comes to stocking options, there's a wide variety of fish species to choose from, each bringing its own charm to your aquarium. From sleek angelfish to colorful clownfish, you can create a visually appealing underwater landscape. Take it to the next level. We have what many consider the pinnacle of the aquarium hobby. This is the reef tank. Reef tanks stand out as a unique saltwater aquarium designed to replicate the vibrant environment of a coral reef. More than just a home for fish, these tanks are a canvas for reef keepers to curate captivating underwater ecosystems, featuring a diverse array of sea creatures. Consider stocking options that go beyond colorful fish species and dive into the world of live corals. With reef tanks, you can add unique creatures such as anemones, starfish, shrimp, snails, and other fascinating invertebrates. The result is a mesmerizing underwater scene that will become the highlight of your living space. Finally, we go for colorful yet dangerous with a saltwater predator tank. Well, well, well. Not all vibrant saltwater fish are as friendly as Nemo here. You can offer some impressive saltwater predators in your tank, provided you select their tank mates thoughtfully. These tanks predominantly focus on the fish, as saltwater predators have a taste for many invertebrates. However, some species can coexist with live corals. Consider stocking options like moray eels, groupers, lionfish, and the marine pufferfish for an aquarium that showcases their wonderful colors and their predatory nature. Those are the types of aquarium setups you can create, but what about the tanks you can just purchase? If you're just starting out or you're already an experienced hobbyist, the next list is perfect for everyone. However, each kind of setup does require some important equipment, and the first choice you'll need to make is the actual aquarium and aquarium stand you're gonna use. So, here are the seven most popular types of aquariums that you could buy. First on the list are nanos. Nano aquariums, typically ranging up to about 20 gallons, have gained popularity for housing small fish such as guppies and bettas. Despite their size, some aquarists venture into keeping saltwater fish in reef tanks in nano aquariums, expanding the possibilities for aquatic enthusiasts. While these tanks may be cost effective and are easier to clean, maintaining critical water parameters can pose challenges, prompting prospective buyers to carefully consider the commitment involved. In the smaller tanks, around 1 to 2 gallons, enthusiasts can introduce invertebrates like snails and shrimp. However, for fish, a 5 gallon tank is generally the smallest recommended size, as only a number of species can thrive in such a confined space. A 20 gallon tank is considered a favorable choice for beginners, offering a more forgiving environment and accommodating a broader range of fish species, including small tropical communities. The second type of tank you can buy are all in once. Starting an aquarium from scratch can be cost effective and an enjoyable endeavor. 
but selecting the right equipment can be challenging for beginners. Thankfully, there are convenient all-in-one setups on the market featuring built-in chambers for heating and filtration. These setups not only streamline the process, but also showcase stylish designs, making them visually appealing. Additionally, models with integrated stands and cabinets provide a convenient solution for organizing your fish tank. This type of tank is available in various shapes and sizes, catering to different preferences and needs. These diverse options open the way for both beginners and experienced hobbyists to find the right setup for their aquatic adventures. There are nano tanks perfect for shrimp or betta fish, medium setups for community fish, and even bigger tanks large enough to impress African cichlids or saltwater predators. Third on our list is the Reef Ready System. Reef Ready Aquariums are specifically crafted for saltwater reef tanks. These tanks are often available pre-drilled, allowing you to customize and install your overflow in some setup. Alternatively, some models come complete with all the necessary components for efficient reef tank filtration systems. The appeal of these Reef Ready all-in-one setups lies in their ability to simplify the often complex and risky DIY tasks associated with setting up a reef tank. With these aquariums, you can save time on intricate installations, leaving you with more time to focus on researching and planning for the vibrant inhabitants of your new reef ecosystem. Glass and acrylic tanks both offer benefits to fish tank owners. In ancient China, the keeping of fish began in ponds and water gardens, where the aquatic life could only be observed from above. Fortunately, modern inventions such as glass and acrylic have revolutionized our ability to enjoy a more immersive view of underwater life. Today, two primary materials, glass and acrylic, dominate the construction of fish tanks, each with its own set of advantages and drawbacks. Glass, the traditional choice, offers economical costs and simple, reliable construction. It's readily available in the standard sizes, too, simplifying the matching process for hoods, stands, and equipment. However, glass is relatively brittle and prone to cracking or breaking when subjected to impacts, and its heavy weight becomes a crucial consideration for larger tanks. On the other hand, acrylic fish tanks boast a broader range of shapes and sizes, making them the preferred option for custom designs. Acrylic, being lighter and more durable than glass, facilitates innovative tank configurations. It's also the most transparent, even beating out low iron glass. However, it is susceptible to scratches if not cleaned with care. Acrylic tanks may become scratched and discolored over time. Fifth on the list, we got cubes and rectangles. For most aquarium setups, rectangular tanks are the preferred choice due to their efficient use of floor space for aquascaping and ample horizontal swimming room for fish, particularly active open water species. Research suggests that larger and more complex environments such as longer tanks can reduce aggression among fish, emphasizing the significance of adequate space and minimizing aggressive behavior. While rectangular tanks are strong, easy to construct, and provide a large surface area for oxygen, cube tanks readily available and visually striking offer an elegant and symmetrical appeal. This symmetry enhances visibility, making cube aquariums ideal for central placements in rooms where they can be viewed from various angles. There's also tall and shallow aquariums for your fish enthusiasm. Aquariums are often available in more than one rectangular shape, such as long or high variations for common tank sizes like 20 gallons and long or breeder shapes for 40 gallons. Long shallow aquariums are generally preferred as they provide more swimming distance for fish and offer a greater surface area for efficient oxygen and carbon dioxide diffusion into the water. However, high and breeder tanks, while needing less floor space, may better be suited for specific aquascapes and reef layouts. Lastly is the rimmed and rimless tank variety. Traditionally, glass aquariums feature solid bracing around the top rim for added strength. However, modern designs often opt for rimless tanks, eliminating the plastic strip along the top edge of the glass. Rimmed tanks, while not as visually pretty, offer great strength, affordability, and protection against chipping. The bracing support allows for the use of lighter glass, reducing overall weight. Rimless tanks, on the other hand, provide a seamless blend between the walls and the water's surface, enhancing aesthetics and creating an open-top view for observing animals and plant life. So, whether you're dreaming of a planted oasis or envisioning a bustling saltwater world, remember that the right tank, knowledge, and vision can turn your aquatic aspirations into reality. Thanks for tuning into this video, and let's dive into more topics next time, or hey, simply just click on the next video on the right. Make sure you don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell before you go. So long.